Some wineries have managed to stay afloat with outdoor wine tasting while others are still struggling. News Channel reporter Reed Harmon shows us the challenges they face. Meet Norman Becco, <laughs> owner of Cottonwood Canyon Vineyard and Winery, a beautiful location in Santa Maria for a glass of wine and an experience beyond the poor. But the beauty has gone to battling. I'm the guy with all the debt. Debt he's gained mostly from a devastating 2020 year. Those used to be grapevines. And I had to pull them out because I couldn't sustain. We were spending $25,000 a month to farm and no income. Right. And I didn't have enough, I couldn't sustain it. It's tough being able to sustain a business when there's no traffic. Again, here we are. This is Thursday in the middle of summer, and we have two people here. Traffic was lost in large part because of Cottonwood's main attraction being unavailable. The county passed a law, you can have cave tours and barrel tasting. Because of COVID? Which affected how many wineries in the area? One. Cottonwood has events going on, trying to keep them on their feet. It's just not enough. It's, it can't make up for all the deficits we had. In, in the past. The pandemic has limited people's desire to return, but one thing is for sure. I mean, the way the staff treats us, uh, the way they explain what each wine tastes like and what pairs with it is just phenomenal. In Santa Maria, Reserve Syrah, which is pruned and made beautiful with a dark magenta color. I'm News Channel reporter Reed Harmon.